Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to my second round um, FA Cup predictions. There was a few surprises in the first round like there often is in the FA Cup. Um, I took your opinions on board. Um, a few of you were saying I didn't do all of them in the first round. I did state in that video I choose I think it was about 12 out of all the fixtures which I predicted. And obviously the ones I did do and you asked you over social media, I did for you as well. Um, but this time round, I'm doing all the predictions in round two. So every game, um, if I do miss a certain game, I do apologise. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. You know what I do. So subscribe for more. Thank you for watching and let's go. So the first game I'm going to talk about is Made of Tippies versus Newport County. Um, sorry if I mispronounced any team names during this video. Um, Made of Tippies, um, you know, had a good first round. Can't quite remember who they beat. Um, Newport County are a very dangerous team coming into uh, the FA Cup. They very much always do well in this competition year in, year out. Or well, I have done for the two, past two to three years. Um, but this could be a very interesting game indeed. Um, and for this one, I'm going to say Newport's going to try, go, try to take it to a replay and go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Cheltenham Town versus Port Vale. Um, both teams. Cheltenham are going into this game around the top of League 2. They're very much a team that looks like they want to you know, get promotion like every team does. Paul Felt are down the opposite end of the table. Um, it's going to be a very interesting game indeed um, because of the FA Cup, because of the uh, mysteries that the FA Cup bring up. So as far as this one goes... I'll go for a 2-1 Cheltenham win. My next one is Forest Green Rovers versus Carlisle. Carlisle yet again sitting at the right end of their table in League 2. Um, Carlisle very much differently sitting at the wrong end of their table. Um, you know, Carlisle are really... Um, you know, really look uh, behind them um, as much of as they do in front. Um, but as far as this game goes, I'll go for a 3 0 Forest Green win. My next one is Kingston versus AFC Fair. Um, both non league teams going into the second round of the FA Cup. Which means that one of these teams will make it to the third round of the FA Cup. Um, where the Championship team and I think the lower end of the Premier League teams come into it. Um, it's just going to be a very interesting game. But for this one, I'm getting another replay. And I'll go for a 0-0 scoreline for that one. And if there's a replay... You know, if you want me to do videos of the replays, please feel free to put it down in the comments below. And I, once all the games have been played and the replays, I will uh, do that for you. Um, my next one is Older Mouth Athletic versus Burton Albion. Um, Oldham are, are quite hard team to summon up. Burton Albion are doing okay in League One. Um, you know, very much off the cuff of what we're doing. Um, yet yeah, again, it proves even when you go down to League One how hard it is to get back up into the Championship. Uh, sorry. Um, but. As far as this one goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Burton Albion win. My next one is Peace Brown versus Dover. Um, Athletic. Um, 
I'm not going to talk about much about this one. David did very well to get through the first round. Um, same with PR, but as this game goes, I'll go for a 3 0 Peterborough win. My next one is Wolves, uh, sorry, Portsmouth versus Erdrick. Yeah, again, sorry for not the team name. You do know what team it is because a badge should appear behind me. Um, but as far as this one goes, I'll go for a 2 0 Portsmouth win. My next one is Shrewsbury Town versus Mansfield. Shrewsbury and Mansfield. Um, Mansfield, I think both teams are sitting down among their tables. Um, I think I think Shrewsbury in League One now. Um, but you know it's going to be an interesting game going forward, which I'll go for another replay, and I'll go for a two-two scoreline for that one. My next one is Walsall versus Oxford United. Um, Walsall, um, how they they are, um, you know, really um, playing okay. Um, probably could be playing better, but so could Oxford. Which one? I go for another replay for this one. And I'm going to go for a one on scoreline for that one. My next one is EC versus Crew Alexander. Um, EC doing okay in the uh, Man League. Crew Alexander are doing ever so well in League One, I think they're in. Um, you know, but still a long way to go in this season with a busy Christmas period coming up for all the football. Um, up and down the country, but as far as this one goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Queer Alexander win. My next one is Blackpool versus Maidenstone United. Um, as far as this one goes, I'll go for a 2-1 Blackpool win. My next one is Bristol Rovers versus Plymouth Argyle. Bristol Rovers did, you know, ever so well to get through um, to round to uh, this round. Um, Plymouth Argyle are having, you know, um, a bit of a 50 50 season. Um, but as I've said, this is a cup full of surprises that it gets. Um, so as far as this result goes, I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one and into another replay. My next one is Coventry City versus Itchwich. Um, Coventry City ain't doing too badly considering they're playing at St Andrews. Itchwich are very much a team that I will. Um, that I am saying we'll get back into the championship. I'm very fortunate to go down. Um, but an all round League One Cup tie, and I'll go for a 2 1 Coventry City win. My next one is Crawley versus Fleetwood. Um, Fleetwood are very much doing their thing. Um, same with Crawley. Um, it's going to be a very interesting game going forward, but I'll go for a 2-1 Fleetwood Town win. My next one is Exeter versus Hartlepool. Exeter sit comfortably at the top of their table. Um, Hartlepool, uh, you know, sitting in non-league. Um, very bleak future. Um, the last thing I heard about Hartlepool. Um, hopefully being saved. Um, obviously, when you go through a recovery process, sorry again. Um, like Hartlepool, it does take quite a while. Which one I'm going for a three nil Exeter City win. My next one is Gillingham versus Doncaster Rovers. Um, 
And for this one, I'm going to go for another replay and I'm going to go for a one on score line for that one. Um, my next one is Northampton Town versus Notch County. Um, yeah, again, I know how well Northampton and Town are doing in League 2. Which one I'm going to go for a 3 1 Northampton Town win. My next one is Rochdale versus Boston United. Um, you know, Rochdale sitting down on the table, Boston United um, getting through to the round two proper. Um, you know, fair play to Boston. Um, but as far as this result goes, I'll go for a 2 0 Rochdale win. Um, my next one is Tramia Rovers versus Colchester City. Um, which one I'm going to go for? A 1 0 Tramia Rovers win. Um, my last one for this weekend is Sully Hull Moses versus Rotherham United. Um, sorry if I mispronounced that team name. Um, but I'm going to go for a 2 nil Rotherham United win but anyway guys if you're going to any of these FA Cup games enjoy your day out um, if you're going on the road have a safe journey um, but anyway guys you know what to do subscribe for more give us a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it um, thanks for watching and ciao for now